up guys and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm basically gonna be doing a build breakdown on my new truck. Uh, just going over everything that's done with it, what I have planned for it and everything like that. But I'm about to head to the car wash. <laughs> That cold start. And then kind of go in here at the bottom. Alright, so before I see any of you guys say anything about me using this car wash, this truck is what, like 15 years old now? And I can guarantee that the paint has seen a lot worse than going through one of these car washes. It's kind of windy up here, so I don't know how well you'll be able to hear me, but. It's a 2005 Silverado. I traded the last truck, the white 2500 HD for it, just straight up. But uh, I'll throw in a walk around clip right now to show how it was before. got a stage 4 Texas Speed truck cam which is the 228-228R, a uh, stage 2 transmission, a 4000 stall, a billet stall from Circle D converters. Uh, I had a custom double wall drive shaft built for it because I did blow the stock drive shaft out but I've done the full SS conversion, the bumper, I even did the interior too. I got the seats and a lot of the inserts but I didn't end up using the SS cluster because I wanted to have the digital message center. Uh, anyway, the interior is pretty nice in here. Got a lot of the red accents. It's on a 5.9 drop, C notched. I uh, just did the cow tracks on it. Recently threw on these Nitto 420s. Uh, they, they work pretty well. They're pretty soft tires, so they ride pretty nice, but I'm still having issues hooking up. So I kind of want to switch on to some uh, race stars with some Mickey Thompson street slicks. But if anybody in the central Texas area is looking to trade with some cash on my end for some race stars, definitely hit me up because I've been looking for some, but I can't really find any. Show you the engine bay real quick. It's nothing special. It's probably pretty dirty in here, but for those of you who want to see, got a little bit of paint match accents. 4 inch intake from K&N, uh, LS3 style heads, it's got a two step tune also, I'll throw in a clip of, of that. I also did a burble tune for around like 3000 RPM so. but I'll also throw in my tuner, a link to his channel, all that stuff. But yeah, it's, it's a pretty quick truck. The last time I got a dyno tuned, it put down 420 to the wheels. So I'm hoping to push a little bit more power out of it. But I think in about a month or so here, towards the end of December, January, I'm gonna rebuild the bottom end, all Texas speed parts, and hopefully slap on a big uh, single precision turbo. Cause I want to go boosted and race this truck, but kind of have to buy a daily first. Cause <laughs> I'm not trying to be daily driving about a 800 horsepower truck. 
I know it's kind of a short video, but I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up the video here. Uh, definitely make sure to subscribe and turn on your post notifications because I have a lot of sick content coming for this truck. With all that being said, make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe, comment, leave a like. <laughs> shit, I ain't just talking. Nigga, I don't talk and I walk it. And I don't do shit without offers. I told you my nigga I'm awesome. I probably got powers like Austin. Pull up to your apartment, I leave it bombing like the marathon running in Boston. Yeah, yeah. Look what I did, huh? Baby, see it. She holding my kid, huh? Home, long. I'm in your crib.